Hello? Can anybody hear me? Is anybody even out there? Is anybody even connecting with me? Can you see me? Can you hear me? Can you feel me? <sighs> yeah, I don't quite understand because I've been in this bubble for a long time. And even though being an inventor puts you thinking ahead of people, you don't always get the credit. So I can understand the uh, frustration of uh, Leonardo da Vinci and uh, quite a few of the masters. It's like, uh, duh, don't you get it? You know, how can something so simple be so strange in your mindset? Um, you know, having invented glow-in-the-dark clothing um, 33 years ago and seeing and understanding the uh, importance back in, in 94 also, um, you know, man, aren't you caught up with me by now? I mean, you know, the World Trade Center, September 11th, 2001. That is why New York Local Law 26 is now in effect and why international law is considering it, which means that all buildings seven stories and higher have to have a glow-in-the-dark escape route system in the world. Now, how much money is that? Yeah, it's a whole lot of money. That's why I can't understand. It's like, wait a minute. Um, or are you like uh, some other people I know and, oh, wait a minute, I like her, her idea. Uh, let's just steal it, you know? Uh, the, the world has gotten really, really uh, corrupt, especially in the corporate world. And that was one of the reasons that I said, man, this is this is bad. You know, that and, well, the guy's doing 20 years, so, you know. Um, yeah, people get what they, they reap. They reap what they sow, the karma. And don't you understand when you steal from somebody, especially when they have nothing, what that karma brings to you? Yeah. <laughs> but I'm here to uh, to testify that the the rewards also also come in um, blessings that you couldn't understand also uh, service is good for the soul doing for others is what um, you know service is all about you know when you hurt one of your own you really rally around but when you're different um, yeah, that's why people rarely want to tear you apart and, and, and not look at the, the good things that, that you can do for society. And there lies my frustration. It's like, um, I feel the passion of the Christ, you know, I, 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 I am a sister. <laughs> Jesus is my brother, you know, just because I understand a whole lot more doesn't mean that you can crucify me underneath your so-called Christian um, uh, definition. Um, you know, it's sad. It's sad. So, um, you know, doing this fundraiser, trying to start another business. And I counted. And this is number nine. Number nine official, not counting Avon or Pampered Chef or Tupperware, or Prince's House, or Tricam. Um, I, I, I love being in business. I'm not a punch the clock, nine to five person. I, 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 I'm one of those 24-8 people. I, I like to work, I like to produce, I like to create. It frustrates me when I work for people and I see solutions to problems or ways to make more more money and and it's hit with a a wall because I am the so-called servant and um, you know I'm not supposed to know things of such that they don't understand so um, yeah it frustrates me that's why I like to work for myself and those of you who don't understand who like to punch the nine to five clock um, hey, you know, more power to ya. Um, I'm going to need you to punch my clock one of these days, too, when I finally get uh, things rolling. So, looking at it, I was considering starting the glow-in-the-dark clothing. And people can't quite understand that. Yes, it is a fad product. Um, it's also a safety product. 
Um, you know, how many times do you wish you had your underwear before you run out the door when there was an emergency? Um, look at the low level lighting system in Oklahoma schools that would have at least calmed the children a little bit more so than complete pitch darkness. Um, that, that's, that's what I want to do. I want to go back into focusing on the safety aspect of it. And uh, one more of my inventions, it's called a Sprite Light. And it is my intellectual property. Uh, I don't want anybody to steal it at this point in time. I've put out a whole lot of other things out there that people have um, capitalized on them. And um, I'm, I'm not real happy and anxious to let that happen again. So I'm going to protect this, like I said, and uh, it's pretty cool. I mean, you know, Glow Butts, the original glow in the dark underwear, Glow For It Originals, uh, safety products, glow and safety. Do you know where you will be when the lights go out? That's a big question. Hurricane season's coming. And um, what are you going to do when your lights go out? Do you have a night light? Do you have batteries for your flashlight? And how long will that flashlight last? Wouldn't you like a rechargeable light that you could, hey, take it outside during the day if there's no light in the house? Yeah, that, that, that cool. And then you'd have a night light all night long. So you would know where the, the door was, where the window was. You'd have something smiling looking down at your children. And uh, they'd be calm at night. Mm -hmm. That's what I want to do. You know, you got to remember that there's always a light in the dark. Just got to glow for it. And if that doesn't work, well, yeah, there's always other things. <laughs> yeah, life is never dull and boring. Love you.